This is Mary at the Mary Atelier, and I am going to participate in Acrylic April, which is a challenge by Cinnamon Cooney, the art Sherpa. And the challenge is to paint a painting a day, an acrylic painting a day. So what I have here are some deco art paints that I've chosen for what I want to paint today. I'll go over the colors as I paint. Now, Cinnamon has several videos out. She encourages doing value studies. I'm going to do the value study as I paint. But I am going to kind of give myself a little mark here so I know where. So this, this canvas is pre or canvas that I primed. And I'm going to put it in my April art journal when I get it bound. <laughs> so eventually I will be working in my April art journal. But I'm going to work page by page here. So today, today I'm going to paint this little gal. So I have her propped up over to the side here. You won't be able to see her. And I have to tell you, when I'm looking at her head on, I don't, this is about what I see. So I have to kind of tip it up a little to see her face. So I have some things propping her up, like my masking tape. And if I bend back a little, see, now you, you can see her, and I'm getting, well, you'll see what I'm getting. Now, because this is a little statuette, it will be very, very conducive to, to value studies. I need just a little bit more of a prop here. There we go. <laughs> and I will be doing my value studies. I will be doing my value studies uh, as I as I work on my painting. I'm going, I'm not going to pre-sketch it. I'm going to sketch it with my paintbrush. And I'll probably need a smaller brush to do that. As an underpainting, let's see if I can find a smaller brush. I don't have special brushes. My brushes are just craft brushes that I get whenever I have a few extra dollars and I'm at the store, at the Hobby Lobby store. So, let's see what I have in here. Uh, I kind of want one. This one might work too. So I'm just going to mix it up. Now, this is kind of a gray, white, uh, cement type and I'm thinking that I'm going to add a khaki tan and white for this. Now I may be reaching for my other white, my apple barrel white just because I like to add it. I do have my deco art white here. I am using mostly deco arts Americana paint. I'll be using all craft paint in here. Craft paint is acrylic. It is a, I call it craft paint. This is really acrylic paint. This is honey brown. I might use some honey brown. But I'm just going to start by sketching her out. I think I'll use this brush to sketch. It's a, it's a new brush. Let's get it wet a little. See what happens. It's got sizing, I guess, in it. That's really not what I want, though. I want a smaller, a smaller brush. Just to do a little brush sketching. And here, this might work. 
So, but my, and my background, I think I'm going to make my background a blue and I've got an ultramarine blue and a cobalt blue. And I'll just be brushing that in. This will be kind of a sketchy painting, I think, at first. Um, value studies. Yeah. Um, as far as value, you can't see what I'm seeing, but uh, I'll be actually kind of sketching in some of the values that I see. It's got kind of a silvery globe here. And let's just get started. Now, my desktop is vinyl here, so I will probably be using my desktop as a palette. I'm not being too picky. I'm not being too picky. And let's see if I can't just squeeze out. Some, oops. I guess I should have. I forget that I have to shake these paints up a little before I use them. <laughs> some of that medium floats to the top. Okay. A painting a day. I don't know if I can keep up with a painting a day. And I think I'll put a little of this burnt umber in there just to get the sketchy tones. Just a little. And I do have I do have a palette to mix with, a palette knife to mix with. 